A Dremel high-speed rotary tool is a handheld power tool that uses high speed and low torque to accomplish a wide variety of tasks. Think of the rotary tool system in terms of tools, attachments, and accessories. Tools are simple enough to understand. Attachments are any product that gets mounted onto a tool, and accessories get placed into a tool. Use the speed control to select a speed that's right for the project you're working on. Depending on the model of tool you own, your speed control may allow you to select from a continuously variable range of speeds between 5,000 and 35,000 RPM, a few predetermined speed settings, a high and low speed, or just on or off. At the front of the tool, you'll find the collet lock button, the tool's nose cap, and the collet assembly, which is mounted to the output shaft. This is the working end of the tool, and these components are very important in understanding how to make use of your rotary tool. Removing and or replacing the tool's nose cap allows you to work with our lineup of rotary tool attachments, like this shield attachment. One thing to keep in mind about attachments is that it's usually easiest to place whatever accessory you wish to work with in the tool before mounting any attachments. For more information about rotary tool attachments and how to use them, check out our attachment methods videos. Working with accessories is super easy, especially since the advent of the Easy Twist nose cap. Simply unscrew the Easy Twist nose cap from the tool, place your accessory all the way into the tool's collet, and then back it out about an eighth of an inch. Depress the collet lock button, slide the nose cap up to the collet nut, and use the nose cap to firmly tighten that collet nut. Removing an accessory works basically the same way, just in reverse. If you don't have an easy twist nose cap, you'll perform the change process with the help of this wrench, which still comes in all rotary tool kits. Just remember to use the right collet because there are four sizes of collets available to accommodate different sized accessory shanks. An eighth inch collet is packed on the end of all tools, and if you look closely at it, you'll see there are no rings on its shaft, unlike a smaller collet whose size is indicated by a series of rings on its base. A 3 32nd inch collet has three rings, the 1 16th inch collet has two rings, and the 1 32nd inch collet has one ring. To switch between collets, simply remove the collet nut and then pull the collet from the 